I will show you how you can bring your Instagram stories to life so you will get the attention you deserve and we're starting right now. What's up fam, my name is Eric and I make tutorials like this one. Today is all about Instagram stories. Now let's get this started and open the editor of your choice. Mine is Final Cut Pro. Open the project and change the video resolution to custom and type in 1080x 1920. That's the vertical format of an Instagram story. Now bring in your picture and scale it up till you can't see any black bars no more. A little disclaimer, this will work the best if you shoot on a tripod and shoot your picture one with the subject and one only the background. But since you and me, we have already shot our pictures we want to put in our story, I will show you today how to do this without the extra background shot. Bring your shot in and cut it to 15 seconds or less. Now duplicate your shot and set one above the other. Search for draw mask and start to mask around your subject. Be as precise as you can when the background is not sky and when the background is sky, this is our chance to hide that those pictures are not two separate shots. But I will show you what I mean in a second. When you finish the mask, Go to the start of your clip and hit the keyframe button on scale. Go to the end and scale the shot up. Now we clearly can see why this works the best with two separate shots. From here I click the keyframe button on position as well to hide the background as good as I can. Then I open the masking points on the sky to hide the rest. Now that works great on that shot except for the shoe. So I decided what I can't hide I maybe should highlight. I duplicated the subject clip and place it underneath the original. Then search for a point somewhere in the middle and stop the movement there. So the shoe keeps duplicating itself. Finally I go to the Instagram profile and make a screenshot. Import that to Final Cut Pro and cut out the original picture by using a shape mask. Now throw a glitch effect on top. Now of course changing the background is not the biggest deal anymore since we already masked out our subject. This is a random beach shot from Google. I have scaled it up and used the feather to blend the sky. Now as I said before, my name is Eric, I do Final Cut 10 Pro tutorials and I have a lot of free plugins so check out all my other videos. If you guys haven't already, smash the sub button down there and follow me on Instagram, lifted underline Eric. Thanks for watching, see you guys in the next one.